guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. All right, today we are gonna talk about a holiday gift guide for men. Gifts for men in your life. So some will be traditional and some might be a little bit more interesting and more unusual, at least I think they are. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump in. <laughs> As always guys if you're already subscribed to my channel I just want to say thank you so very much and if you are not yet subscribed hit that subscribe button and that notification bell um, let me just start by saying you haven't seen a video for me in a little while it's probably been like a week and a half um, we had a fur baby death in our family so it was very traumatic and very horrible and very unexpected and um, I honestly didn't feel like filming anything at all. Um, it just didn't seem to matter, you know? Beauty and fashion and, and makeup, it's all fun and it's all great. Um, but when you lose a part of your family, of course, that's just, just really doesn't matter. So that's why I haven't been here, but I am back and I'm trying to get in the swing of things. So let's go ahead and jump in. Um, I'll start with the more traditional gifts that you may um, give to the person in your life, whether, you know, if you have an older son, if you, you're, you know, your father, uh, uncle, these are all great. Um, boyfriend, husband, um, these work. I'm going to start with cologne. Now, I'm very picky about cologne. Um, as well as perfume. Um, so my husband um, wears Versace. He wears this one here. This is the Versace. Oh, it's upside down. Versace por home. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. But it's the blue bottle. Oh my God. It smells so divine, y'all. If you have not smelt this, I know it's very hard to give somebody fragrance um, if, you know, they haven't tried it. But this one is just divine. At least I love it and I love it on my husband so this is a Christmas gift for him my husband loves pajama bottoms and sort of an everyday you know it's one of those gifts you kind of get every year um, but these ones are really awesome um, I got these from Nordstrom's and they're just super comfy and super soft and I got them a couple pair I got them the and black check and then also the gray and black check and these are just really great ones they wash well um they hold up well so these are some good ones if you're looking for some pajamas so if you're looking for hoodies billabong has some awesome hoodies um also off of nordstrom's and i love billabong hoodies these are really cute um this is actually for a different family member. I can't say who. Um, I've told them they're not allowed to watch the gift videos, but you know, whether they pick or not, I don't know. But um, I really love their uh, hoodies, the Billabong hoodies, and they're really super soft. So those are great. Those are all kind of traditional. Now let's go ahead and talk about accessories. Um, I have mentioned Yod watches before. Um, I own one. Um, my husband owns one and he's about to get another one um, But I thought that I would show you how they're beautiful and right now y'all you can still get them In time for Christmas. I just checked their website and the best part is they're on sale majorly on sale um, So they come in the most gorgeous wooden box. It has the uh, Yod stamp it has a little drawer here where you can put um, the wood preservative these are wood watches and there's a magnetic lid and then when you open it up um, I love the Frankie series so the watches that I'll be showing you today are from the Frankie series it's just the series that I like um, the first watch this is the first watch I ever got him this is the dark sandalwood and emerald face and then it has the gold lettering it's beautiful one of the things my husband says he likes most about it is it's extremely light it's wood you forget you have it on I, I have to agree with that I, I didn't know until I got my own I was like oh my gosh you're totally right um, so it's absolutely beautiful and the presentation is gorgeous and guys just to give you an example that is normally $190 and it's on sale for $157. I know, it's crazy. And then I have the ebony in gold. And so it's just a dark face. I like that, very neutral. And then the one that I got him is gonna be completely different. Let me just show you. 
This is zebra wood with navy. Isn't that beautiful? I would show it to you because my brain's not thinking. I've wrapped it already. Yeah. I know. Not too brilliant here today. Um, I, I wrapped it a few days ago, just not even thinking. Um, but um, beautiful gift. Now, I've gotten my husband over the years, is since we do, he does like watches, is a leather watch case. And this one has been engraved. And, um, it has a little lock and key. And so you just open it up and you can store 10 watches. Um, he has random stuff in here as well. Um, and so it's nice. It keeps his watches safe and protected and it looks good. <laughs> so I love that as well. Now let's talk about sunglasses. One of my favorite brands of sunglasses is Diff um, eyewear. I love their sunglasses. And um, my favorite pair, oh, and they're in the car, I'd show you, is by Jesse James Decker. I have shown these glasses multiple times. Um, I absolutely love them. Um, they sell out all the time. If they have the female aviators for, for Jesse James Decker, I will put them. Um, now, Eric Decker uh, came out with a men's collection, and I got my husband a pair of aviators. And they're very similar to mine, um, except just, I will put them on. Obviously, they're meant for a man's face, but um, I think they're really cool. So um, they're very lightweight, um, which I love about them. They don't pinch. They don't um, hurt in any way. They don't squeeze the nose. I mean, they're just the perfect pair of sunglasses. So these aren't perfectly round. They're actually um, not round or oval. They're just... Uh, kind of a combination so they're really cute cool comes with you know the little cloth to keep them clean so you pop open the case and there you have it and oh my gosh the case is beautiful as well so these are Eric and Jesse by Eric and Jesse I think it's really cute that her husband and her both came out with um, kind of matching aviators so little tech gadgets um, I have two here. These are big. This would make a great stocking stuffer, and might be what I do. Um, my, we don't smoke, obviously, but you know sometimes you need a lighter. We we always need a lighter, to, whether it's lighting the fireplace or lighting the fire pit, or you know we're camping. This one um, has this atomic lighter. I think it's so cool, and it just charges um, by like a USB port so it's so cool and it's not even really a flame it's it's does it's no fuel nothing no flint no flame it won't blow out um so i think it's really kind of cool and it's just one of those unusual little gifts next um is a camera this is by z edge this is a 4k action camera so it's a video and a camera it's waterproof um you know it's <laughs> shockproof pretty much you can almost do anything with this. This has excellent, excellent review. Watch this tech guy. He always does like the latest and greatest, um, you know, best deals and stuff like that. I'll list his, um, I can't think of his name, but I'll list his uh, YouTube handle in the description box. He's awesome. So anyways, he recommended this um, and uh, so I'm excited to give this as well. Husband, okay, if your husband doesn't drink bourbon, doesn't drink alcohol, doesn't smoke cigars, um, this, none of this is probably for you then, but let's start with the most unusual gift. I found these quite some time ago and I am, I love this gift. Everyone I give them to, every man that I give them to, I have men in my life, um, love them. And what they are, are single malt infused toothpicks. And this is how they come. So it's a little box and you get, if I recall correctly, four of these glass vials. This is um, when my husband is still working on it. It has a little cork and you just pull the cork out. One, there's 10 and each one of them is then infused. So they're really um, very interesting, very unusual um, and they're Danson's. So they're white birch natural botanicals um, with superior spirits infused. So this is single malt number 16. Um, my husband loves these. I gave them to um, my papa. He loves them, and they're going to another family member. Well, actually, I have 
a couple of them for gifts. I think they make an awesome gift. Kind of going with the same theme as the uh, toothpicks. My husband likes cigars and he likes bourbon. <laughs> hey. Um, so I created for Father's Day, but I think this would work for Christmas. If you already have a bark cart, I'm gonna show a video here of it. Um, what I did was I went and got a bark cart and then I completely designed it for him for Father's Day. Um, so this would definitely work for Christmas. Uh, some of my favorite pieces I'm just gonna show you besides obviously the cart itself, which is gorgeous. Um, I absolutely love this decanter set. So this is the decanter and then these are the glasses. It comes with the decanter and four glasses. They're gorgeous because they're silver and gold. Absolutely beautiful, they have a nice weight to them. And then if you want, and if you want a little more traditional, I have this gorgeous decanter and these glasses. So this is a little more um, kind of the traditional where it's the cut glass, which is very beautiful. So then found some wine glasses that sort of have the silver and the gold and um, just different. Some of them have stripes, some of them have uh, polka dots. Uh, you can see here this one has polka dots. They're just beautiful. So I have that. And then what I did is you can see that I put like, um, I love wood, so I put pieces of wood to, um, one was a trivet and the other was a serving you know piece of wood i'm so sorry they're doing the yard next door um and so it looks just you know really pretty and then i found some gorgeous glassware so some highball these are beautiful as well they have the gold um with silver and then uh some stemless wine glasses as well and uh sort of set the whole thing up and then at the very bottom, I just put a simple, what does it hold, three, four, five, a simple six piece wine um, uh, holder. Uh, and we keep some of our wine there. And then, okay. So my husband, like I said, he does like uh, whiskey and bourbon. So this is a, a gift that my daughter had gotten. Um, my husband for his birthday and this is really pretty they have these little tiny little um, bourbon glasses and then it comes with the and the whiskey stones so you freeze the little stones and that way your whiskey or bourbon doesn't get watered down and then a pair of little tongs and this makes a beautiful gift also pick up uh, these are what the little I just pulled these ones out of our fridge these ones stay cold and here's what uh, some whiskey stones um, and they're awesome. It doesn't have to be for whiskey. You, you know, if, if you want anything, whether it be bourbon, scotch, a cognac, anything that you want on the rocks that you don't want to be watered down, these are awesome. All right, let's now talk um, cigars. We just got done with bourbon. I keep a few cigars uh, just in like um, one of the uh, glasses, like one of the rocks glasses. Um, and then the other thing, we also will put like the little stirs to make mixed drinks. These are silver and super pretty. All right. And then um, another great gift would be a humidor. Um, if you have a man that loves to smoke a cigar occasionally. My husband's not a big smoker, but occasionally he will have a cigar. And um, there, this one is beautiful. It's a beautiful mahogany box. Um, it does have the little humid humidity gauge on it. And um, this is beautiful as well. All right, to go along with the cigars, another really nice little stocking stuffer would be a cigar cutter, and this is a beautiful one. Um, it's very weighted and uh, cuts very well, so my husband says, and it's a nice little stocking stuffer as well for Father's Day. So whether you're looking to, you know, completely set up a kind of a portable little mini bar, um, we're not huge drinkers, but you know, we do, um, entertain so it's a nice place to put everything and just to go and grab a wine glass or a rocks glass or a highball glass and a nice place to put some of our favorite wines and um, also you know his cigar All right guys so that's it I hope you have enjoyed these gifts for men um, these are some of my favorite things some of the things that I've already given my husband and some of the things I will be giving him this Christmas holiday. So I hope you all have a wonderful holiday and I will talk to you very soon. Bye guys.